um, the weather kind of got a little cold and windy and I didn't want to film in the windy weather. So here is some asparagus that we have. You can see a little shoot. We're just learning about our asparagus here. Some more and some more. Here are the carrots which haven't come up which only a few have come up and our garlic obviously right there but we have a little bit of carrots and some right over here and we have some right over here you can see it but we'll try to work on that and here is our other box things are going well I need to get some mulch on these but our sweet peas look like they're doing well our cauliflower doesn't look so well cabbage have a lot of aphids so get the ladybugs in there here's some lettuce different kinds of greens and then we got some spinach that look pretty good and our chard isn't coming up that well over here then we have over here we have more sweet peas and these took a little bit longer we replanted so hopefully they'll come back up we have some Japanese salad turnips over here I think a lettuce got thrown in there plus some radishes and we've picked some radishes. That's the nice thing about radishes, they're very fast and the kids like them. Over here, some more cabbage. And then we have some right here. And then we got our two okra are coming up. Get out of the shade. And then our um, um, why am I drawing a blank here? Our uh, Cucumbers haven't come up, so we're going to replant those. It did get a little cold. There's our nice little um, the Mexican sage there. Here's some more onions and garlic. Looking good. Getting ready to pick the garlic soon. Here is our beans, different types of beans. We have our pole beans right here that are starting to come up. We have some lima beans and some regular burgundy beans. And so hopefully they'll come up, and if not, we'll replant. Some little guys over here we have this is going to be a little salsa area but a little cold weather happened I bought these tomatoes and they didn't last which I'm bummed about but we'll have to get some other this one is a little green so maybe it will come there and uh, pepper lost its leaves but it's still green so I hope and I don't think I have anything else coming up over here but that's gonna be peppers and tomatoes and hopefully I'll try growing them up over here I just planted these, some beans. Over here and I'll have some tomatoes once I build my frame. Here is our squash slash melon mounds. Over here, here's a watermelon. Now, hey, it looks green, it might make it. And we also planted some. But over here we have okay, some watermelon coming up, two of them. But you can see the mounds over here. My wife, Catherine, decided to try something new. Um, here's a sunflower that came up from last year that we didn't even plant, but we like it. And here is, I think it's either zucchini or elk squash, or maybe even be a, a random assortment here. And over here we have a patty pan that I bought that we thought we lost in the cold weather, but there it is. Over here we have our onion mixture. The onions did really well. Um, and then we have our spinach that we have used with two of them here and right here and cut them and they grow back it's wonderful it's nice to have your homemade or your uh, garden fresh salads over here we have some pumpkins uh, mounds same kind of thing and we have one coming up right here and then we have a couple coming up right here and then we decided we saw this in a Disney Family Fun magazine about a sunflower house so we planted sunflowers and in amidst the weeds we have some sunflowers coming up and so hopefully they'll come up in this area and we'll have a house that the kids can go in full of sunflowers and then this our little compost area that I've made a little bit smaller than before and using some of it and over here we have blueberries that they look very green but they've lost their leaves right there. And then I was worried I planted raspberries. Didn't think anything was happening. And then I noticed the other day we have some leaves on the bottom. So 
I hope to get something out of our raspberries. Well, anyway, this is our garden, and today is May 20th. I have an update come up in the next couple weeks, but here it is. So, oh, I forgot one last one actually. So, before I sign off, here are the two other ones that get a little bit more shade. Here is some. I think it's a New Zealand spinach, which I could be wrong, and I'm surprised we haven't got any more. And That's then, charred. oh, charred, sorry. Charred. And then here's some more of the greens. So, have a great day, and I'll see you later.